Dear Ryan, can you do the longest hey guys ever? Yeah, I don't know when that became a thing. Obviously, that's not just my thing. A lot of vloggers say that. I know why I started doing it. I guess I never really told you guys this, but originally when I started making videos and vlogs, I would say like three to four different hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Basically, just kind of as a test. In the same way, that's how lamps became a thing for me because I used to use a lamp to focus on because I used to film by myself. Now that I think about it, a lot of the signature things that I do are kind of just because I was lazy or because I didn't have friends. But anyway, back to the Dear Ryan. Although all the people who do Hey Guys to start their videos, this is gonna be the longest one. This is a record, so make sure I gotta get a deep breath and do it at the right note. <clears throat> all right, here we go. Hey! Dear Ryan, can you repaint a famous painting, please? Repaint a famous painting? Oh, you mean like the famous painting that's, you know, in the background of a bunch of videos that we've done? Hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. I mean, I'm not even a good drawer, let alone a painter, but that's really simple. I'm pretty sure I could do that. Voila, it is complete. But you didn't do anything. Look closer, you'll see it's exactly the same. Pretty sure they wanted you to paint a famous painting. Kind of like Starry Night by Van Gogh. Not everyone has seen Starry Night, but everyone has seen a painted white wall before. So you tell me, who is the more famous painter? Vincent Van Gogh or Ryan paints wall? paint. Dear Ryan, read your entire book on camera. How to write good. Yeah, I guess I can do that as long as you guys can keep up with me. You guys say that I talk too fast. You should see me when I read. I don't even read the words. That's how fast I can read. Here we go. Ryan Higa's How to Write Good by Ryan Higa. That's me. Prologue. Prologue. Prologue? My editor told me I might want to start with a prologue. <laughs> Will you guys stop? How am I supposed to finish reading this and prove to everyone that I'm a quick reader if you guys keep turning off the lights? <sighs> Where was I? Who doesn't know the difference between your and your, so you know you're in good hands. That's the end of the prologue. Chapter one. Who is your story about? <laughs> God. Dear Ryan, can you make a half court shot blindfolded? I just made a video about stupid inspirational sayings. High five to those of you that watched it. Or slap in the face, depends where you're holding your phone. But for those of you that didn't see that video, I kind of made fun of those, you know, very cheesy inspirational quotes. And there was quite a handful of people who took it seriously and got really upset about it. They used it. to say things like, oh, you used to be so inspirational, why are you so negative now? Well, maybe you guys are right, and I should be living by these quotes. Specifically one that relates directly to this dear Ryan. I think the quote was something like, you miss every shot that you don't take, or something like that. And well, I wasn't gonna waste the time to actually try to attempt this dear Ryan because it's ridiculous. I guess if I'm living inspirationally, like this quote says, I have no choice. Man, you see that? Steph just shot the ball like five feet behind the three-point line. I've seen further. Please, I'll give you 50 bucks if you can make that shot on your first try. Is that all? Fine. I'll give you 100 bucks if you can make it on your first shot. $200 if you can do a half-court shot. <laughs> I could do that blindfolded. Okay, $500 if you can make a half-court shot blindfolded. You got a deal. Deal? You think we should stop holding hands? Yeah, probably. So you're sure about this? $500 for a half-court shot blindfolded? What are you doing? Are you seriously gonna drink before you do this? Before I do what? Before you take the shot. I didn't say anything about taking it. What do you mean you're not gonna take it? <sighs> there it is. It's perfect, pay up. What? I just made exactly a half court shot blindfolded. You owe me 500 bucks. Seriously? If you want, we can go double or nothing. I can make a full court shot too. See, even if you don't take the shot, you can still make it. How's that for inspirational sayings? Dear Ryan, do a classical song of Humble by Kendrick Lamar. I'm sure you guys have heard this song already. They played this song so much on the radio here in Vegas. I mean, remember when they played this song like a thousand times during the NBA playoffs? It was like every single commercial. And honestly, I did, really didn't like it at first. But the more I heard it, the more I started to kind of like it. If you somehow don't know what song I'm talking about, this is a short snippet of what it sounds like. My left stroke just went viral. Right stroke, put a baby in the spiral. So 
you want me to make that classical? I'm assuming just like how I did the doo-doo on the beat. Although as much as I heard that song, I really don't know what he's actually saying other than be humble, sit down, some other words that I'll probably have to change. Let me look at the lyrics real quick. Humble lyrics. Nobody pray for me, even a day for me away, yeah, yeah, a. Hey. I remember syrup sandwiches and crime allowances. When does he say that? What? AM to the PM, PM to the AM funk. My left stroke just went viral. I know that part, that's the only part I know. My left stroke just went viral. Oh, here we go, corks. It says Be humble, hold up little Sit down, little Be humble. I think we can work with this. We can make this song classical. We can make this song classy. Nobody pray for me. Not even a day for me. Well, yeah. Yeah. I. I remember syrup sandwiches and crime allowances. Vanessa and word with some counterfeit. But now I'm counting this Parmesan where my account lives. I'm down in this to say with my boo and it tastes just like Kool Aid for the analysts. For the analysts, I can buy your ass the world with my paste up. Oh, that kitty good, won't you sit it on my taste plus? I get way too petty once you let me to the extra. Like I said, yeah, I don't know if any of that was in key, but um, I feel like I had to... Let's get this video started. Hey, guys! So leave your question in the comments below, and you could be responsible for the next video. I don't want to get through deep. Mm, that's scary. Oh my God. No! <laughs> what, what happened was the wind, huh? Yep, the wind straight away took it off. Run on data!